just for a minute. Oh, hi. Hi. Uh, where am I? I'm over in the corner. I'm over in the corner by the exit sign. People told me to tell you where I am. Hi. Oh my goodness. All these nice faces. Welcome. Welcome to the National Performance Network's 35th Annual Conference. I know most of you can't see my face, which is fine. You'll see a lot of me the whole rest of this week. Uh, George, do you need like a thing to stand on? I mean, no offense. You're good? We're going to see a lot of you this week, too. All right. Um, I'm really excited to uh, introduce George Shear, who is the new executive director here at the Contemporary Arts Center. And uh, one of our main hosts for the National Performance Network Conference this week. And George is going to say a few words of welcome for us here this evening and then uh, kick off the taco truck performance that's happening. Um, and if y'all in the back want to just move a little bit closer to the stage, it's going to be a little intimate performance for the taco truck theater. So while George is saying hello, you can make your way a little bit further this way. And George Shear, welcome to New Orleans. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, everyone. Welcome. To the CAC, it is such a delight and a pleasure to have you all here. Um, my name is George Shear. I've been here since October. <laughs> I am so blessed and privileged to be here. And this network is um, such a, an incredible... I understand the CAC to have had a long-standing history as part of NPN. Yes. And... Um, Coming into a new place and a new position, it's an opportunity to think about and revere the work that has been done, uh, and also to think forward about the work that can be done, uh, and that we're responsible and um, to do. And I was looking just for a moment at the um, at the mission of NPN and thinking how an organization that has been doing what artists have been doing, is supporting artists who've been doing great work in cultural equity um, for many, many years, but has turned in a way to directly look at that work and to call it out and to make it explicit in the mission and narrative of the way they talk about their work. And it has brought me to thinking through this weekend about um, the work that we do that has been long in support of artists here in New Orleans and work nationally and what it is for us to turn and sort of say explicitly the work that we do in racial and cultural um, equity uh, and economic equity here in the city. Um, so this is just a, a thought that I'm driven by as I begin this, and I, I really appreciate everybody here. Um, and I, I welcome you all. Um, please, if you notice one of our staff members, they have been putting this work together, building out this space. Uh, it is an incredible team. I hope that you will all take a moment throughout this week to uh, also visit the exhibitions that we have. Uh, Meg Turner's on the second floor and Micheline Thomas, uh, New Orleans Airlift. Uh, these are all spectacular, spectacular work uh, and we're really blessed to have it here. Um, and so, welcome again. Jose Torres Tama. Uh, is our uh, per beginning performance this evening. He was a recipient of the National Performance Network's commissioning fund and has been presented around the world. We're very excited to host Teatro Sin Fronteras and the Taco Truck Theater.
gentlemen, enchiladas y burrito. The Talk on Track Theater, El Teatro Sin Fronteras, ha comenzado. It has begun. I am your conceptual coyote. And we howl at the collective missing moon. Oh! Borders, where we're going to cross into Bilingolandia. Yeah. And you won't even need a passport. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. Así que, al fin los oídos, despierten la subconsciencia y ajusten sus cinturones filosóficos. Do not be afraid, amigos y amigas, porque se habla español aquí. Yeah. Do not be afraid of the Spanish language because tostitos are here to stay. Yeah. In fact, we are here to prove fat free and good for the economy. So if you are bilingually challenged, sharpen your ears, <laughs> awake your subconscious, and adjust your philosophical seatbelt. Okay. Oh, wow. Pídele a Legua, pídele a Legua que nos abra el camino. Pídele a Legua que nos abra bien la puerta. Pídele a Legua que nos abra el camino. We petition Legua to open wide the pathways. Legua. Ache. Ache. We petition Legba to open wide the doorways. Ashe. We petition Legba to open up the crossways. Ashe. Yeah, that's it. Fire water. We petition Legba to open wide the pathways. To open up the crossways for people crossing every day, every hour, every second to reclaim what was ours in the first place because the land never had any borders. No borders. Because our hearts have no borders. Because this performance ritual is without borders. Porque este rito performativo no tiene frontera. And we say, Ashe! Ashe! We remember the ancestors. Yemaya! Oshun! Ashe! Ashe! Cuando veo esas caras oscuras quemadas por el sol, morenas con la tierra golpeada, aguantando gritos entre un siglo al otro, casi acabadas como armas viejas, antes de cruzar, como una historia cruel llena de conquistas y abusos. When I see these dark faces, burnt by the sun, purple, black like a dinner, and they're extreme from one century to another, almost finished like old souls before crossing over. With a cruel history of conquest and abuse, like a people in the wounded body of an open child before God, abandoned by a criminal government, forced to cross a colonial star on the back of our Pachamama, Mother Tierra, una cicatriz colonial, crossing into the so-called beacon of democracy, only to be dehumanized, criminalized, called illegal, called alien. No human being is illegal. No human, no human being is illegal. And what the end crowd says, no human being is illegal. No human being is illegal. No human being is illegal. Come on now. No human being is illegal. No human being is illegal. No human being is illegal. And the word is illegal. Ser humano es ilegal. Ningún. Ser humano es ilegal. Ni raza. Ningún. Ser humano es ilegal. Ningún. Ser humano es ilegal. No tengo paciencia para gente sin conciencia. No tengo 
madres y niños están cruzando por pan y sueños en una cicatriz colonial. Mm, yeah. Yo vengo de todos venimos de todas partes. Yo vengo de todos lados, no vine a quitarte nada, venimos a crecer contigo, no vine a quitarte nada, trabajo de día y de noche, el sol se acuesta en mi espalda, conmigo traigo esperanza, alegría y sufrimiento, conmigo traigo mi alma. deny your conscience that you were here first. We've all come to this land for some dream. Let's dare to remember, you've come from somewhere else. Why do you seek to destroy me? I'm here to work with you. You've come from somewhere else. I've come from somewhere else. Venimos de toda parte. Let's dare to remember we are on sacred lands. Let's dare to remember the native people whose blood has been spilled in this territory. When I call out the names, you call them out with me. The Atacapa. The Chato. The Chitimacha. The Cado. The Natchez. The Homa. The Tunica tribe. Let's dare to remember Atacapa. Cado. Chitimacha, Chato, Homa, Natchez, Tunica tribes. Let's dare to remember against a culture that imposes amnesia. Remember and call them by their name. Remember and call them by their name. If I die, cause I can't. 
can't breathe If I die with no reprieve If I die cause I can't grieve Somebody call my name Somebody call my name Somebody call my name Somebody call my name Fallen, and for you to collectively call out the names 
You can't even call it a seven year anniversary because it's the remembrance of the seven year death and slaughter of Trayvon Martin. Come on now, by George Zimmerman, who's now suing the family for the trauma he had to the experience. Come on now. Call out the names, call them out. Come on, people. Philando Castillo. Oh, come on. Yes, come on. We were performing in Tulsa, Oklahoma, when Terrence Crutcher, who was slaughtered by a white police woman, she was a